Hi everyone, today I wanted to share with you a very quick, very simple, and kind of masculine card, um, a Miss You card, using Stamper's Best uh, Phone Booth stamp. And it's a really cool stamp, I'm not going to show you the same because I just cleaned it and put it away, but it's available in unmounted, mounted, and mounted and professionally trimmed. And when it's mounted, it comes on plastic. When it's unmounted, it'll come on a piece of cardboard. Exactly the same information. But that's what that is. And I stamped it using acid-free frost white pigment ink from Colorbox on black American Crafts cardstock on craft paper, uh, note cards, and envelope. And all I did is stamp it in. Um, pigment ink takes longer to dry, just so you know. Um, I try not to heat set textured paper because it has a tendency to pucker and buckle so I just let it air dry and you have to give it a significant amount of time I would say 15 minutes if you have humidity in your area longer or you could do a gentle blotting with a paper towel just an up and down motion like that without rubbing it because it would disturb the image so it does need to dry it's completely dry now and then I made a little envelope with my McGill a mini envelope punch and put a little note in there with a piece of on a piece of black um, cardstock just saying miss you ran some twine around the black cardstock and mounted it and added a little bit of a dash line around the outside so very simple and very mask you know masculine no flowers but it certainly conveys a point and the stamp is really stinking cute it is mm, three and a quarter by uh, one and a half so it would fit on an ATC card so how cute would that be the details are really nice so I just thought I'd try something a little different a little more masculine uh, for all the guys in our lives who you might miss if you have any questions about any of these products please leave me a comment don't forget to stop by Stamper's Best and st I will include a link to both Stamper's Best online store as well as to their uh, YouTube channel where you can check out other Stamper Best um, designers and see what they're creating. If you have any questions, leave me a comment. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching.